Hi guys, in this video I'd like to show you guys a quick demo on some of the smart features on our new range of uh, Acuvox um, intercoms. Now guys, some of the features that I'm about to show you guys is so advanced, there's nothing like it on the market. Um, also guys, um, the features that I'm about to show you guys um, is plug and play. So there's no setup required whatsoever. Um, so out of the box, it will just work. So let's begin. So I've got a standard setup here, uh, single door station with two monitors. Um, so when I press the doorbell, it will call the monitor and my phone without any setup whatsoever. Okay. Okay. So again, guys, plug and play. So the next feature that I'd like to show you guys is multi-location calling. So basically what that means is you can have a secondary monitor in a completely different um, uh, site, whether it's your home, um, your office, or whatever that may be. Um, in this case, we'll just call it building A. So if someone comes uh, comes and press a doorbell at building A, building both the monitor for building A and B will call at the same time. So you guys, can, as you can see here, I've got this monitor plugged into a 4G router, uh, and this one uh, is using a local internet connection. So let's press the doorbell. Okay. You can see. So furthermore guys, the Kuvox door station can work standalone. So there's no need for a monitor. Okay, so as you guys can see, press the doorbell and it'll call the monitor. Okay, again guys, plug and play. Um, also, one thing I forgot to mention, um, the multi-location calling, as I show you guys over here, is plug and play as well. So there's no setup required whatsoever. Okay, now not only that the door station can work uh, standalone, the monitor can also work standalone. Okay, so we've got a basic setup here, two monitors. Now you can have one monitor um, uh, located uh, on building A, uh, the second monitor located uh, in a completely different site, we call it building B, and they'll be able to communicate with each other. Okay, so we'll be able to call the monitor that. Also call my phone from the app. Okay. I can also from my app call the monitor as well. Okay. I can also uh, do a FaceTime call. So as you guys can see here, FaceTime call. So FaceTime call. Okay. Well, not only that guys, you'll be able to use uh, this monitor to view up to four cameras at the same time without timing out. Uh, you can also download apps. So I've got here the uh, Dawa app, the Hick app and the Fabara app. So I've got the camera set up on the, uh, the Dawa app. So as you guys can see. Okay. Not only that guys, we're able to set basic automation on, uh, on this intercom system as well. <clears throat> so I've got a basic setup here. Um, so what we're gonna do, we're gonna, we're gonna tell the, the, the new, uh, the, 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 the door station, when motion is detected, turn turn on the light, and at the same time, call my phone. Okay, so let me just remove that. <clears throat> okay, just let it refocus. Okay. So as it detects motion, that light should turn on. Okay, and it will call me at the same time, as you can see there. Okay. So the possibility is 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 huge guys so not only that you can control lights you can actually uh, um, <clears throat> create events and control other devices okay now that's not all okay <clears throat> apart from automations we'll be able to um, we can also use the door station as a standalone access control unit okay so i've got a basic setup here 
um, I'm using the strobe to replicate uh, a striker so at least that way when um, uh, uh, when it triggers you guys can see uh, the light flashing okay so I've got a door station uh, 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 a striker connected to a, a, a single door station with uh, an exit button okay so I can then open the latch Okay. Not only that, guys, I'm able to add a secondary uh, code pad or a card reader to this door unit. Okay, as you guys can see here. Welcome. Please come in. Okay. Now, that's not all, guys. Now, <clears throat> I've got another uh, a door station here. Now, keep in mind, guys, this striker or strobe if you like is connected to this door station now i'm able to from this monitor send commands to this door station so when we trigger uh, uh when we send out a, a, a trigger it will open a striker on this uh that's connected to this door unit okay as you guys can see nothing's connected on here so being a facial recognition i've set my face to to this doorbell so when it sees my face, it should trigger the relay that's connected to this door unit. Okay. Welcome. Welcome. As you guys can Please see there. Come in. Welcome. Please okay. come in. Not not only that, guys. <clears throat> with you, with, you can do a lot more with facial recognition. Um, so for example, I've uploaded my face here uh, onto this new unit. So every time I um, um, approach the unit and recognize my face. I can program it so it calls me automatically without pressing any buttons, okay? You can, you can also program it or uh, uh, program a blacklist, for example. Um, so when certain people approach the, uh, 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 the door station, it will either send you a notification or actually call you directly, as, we can, uh, as I can demonstrate here. Yeah. So I've added my face, Welcome. Matt, Please come in. and it's calling Welcome. me directly, okay? In without me having to do anything. Okay. Okay. Now, apart from the, <clears throat> that's not all guys, apart from able to use this as a standalone unit, you'll be able to use um, any of the Kubox door station and integrate that with a third party access control panel. So, you know, being a Bosch, um, Challenger, Integrity, um, or a Kuvox access control panel. Any access control panel that, that takes Wigan protocol, you'll be able, be able to, 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 to add, you know, end of the door station and use that as a card reader, right? So instead of using their own card reader, install a, a Kuvox uh, uh, door station and have it uh, as a card reader. And at the same time, uh, you've got the intercom feature as well. Okay. All right. Now, let's talk about the two-wire system. So I've got a, uh, <clears throat> okay. So we have a two-wire system set up here. Now again, guys, the Acuvox two-wire range, there's no need for a hub, right? So in um, most of the co uh, competitor, you require a hub, uh, a central hub, so all the monitors can connect back uh, to that central hub. Not so for this new, uh, this Acubox 2 wire system. So actually, as you can see here, we've got four monitors daisy chained, All right? Now, the, the beauty of these two wire system is I can apply power to any of these monitors. So I don't need to ap apply power to all of them. I can choose, you know, uh, to power this monitor or this monitor or this monitor. Um, so pick one and it'll power the, uh, the rest up. Okay, as you can see, so we've powered this monitor up, and the rest has got power through there. Now, to get this on uh, onto your phone, um, these monitors these monitors supports Wi-Fi. So all all you, all you need to do is connect any of these monitors, any, any one of these monitors, to Wi-Fi. So there's no need to connect all all the monitors to the Wi-Fi at the same time. Okay, so just for exercise purpose, I've connected this monitor to Wi-Fi. Um, these are not on Wi-Fi, okay? So as you guys can see here, press the doorbell. Okay, it's ringing, and it's calling my phone as well. Okay, now, 
the our new range of smart intercom guys is more than an intercom system so you've got your plug and play um, intercom features so absolutely no setup whatsoever um, out of the box it will work both um, on the monitors and onto your phone uh, you can do basic automations and you can also have the options to use it as a standalone access control panel or um, integrate that with a third party access control panel okay the possibility is amazing guys so if you have any questions uh, please do get into contact with us um, and we'll be able to uh, provide you more details thanks guys